it's me Val welcome toxic free thanks for clicking okay um this is going to be a mouthful I can never say it happy belated narcissist awareness day there we go I've said it so I've done that a few times and got my teeth all twisted um I'm really glad that there is a awareness day um makes me feel validated um it's on the map and um last year I didn't realize the first one was last year uh, mind you last year I was in my black hole so I wouldn't notice if aliens have landed but um, yeah, brilliant. I'm so pleased. Um, I've written a few stuff down. As you know, I'd like to do that because I can. Happy belated Narcissist Abuse Awareness Day. This makes me finally feel validated. But awareness is something you and I didn't have. We found out the hard way. Oh, we all have it now, awareness that is. But had we all had this information before meeting the narc, what a lot of heartache, stress and permanent scarring we could have been avoided. But how do we bridge that gap between us, the survivors, to those who have not yet had the displeasure to bump into one of these disordered people? Those who are living with, dating or being brought up by a narcissist, we all know that they exist, we've experienced them. But growing up, we're told, don't talk to strangers, don't get into unmarked taxis alone, always meet new dates in a public place. We know the red flags of a cheater and an adulterer. We've been warned about them. We check their phones for proof. We ask friends for their history. We know bruises show. All the other forms of abuse are real, in your face, understood, believed and shared without any confusion, disbelief or doubt. Narcissism is the hardest thing to convince, to explain, to be understood by others, to be believed and be validated. It's invisible. Those who've been through it you watching this now, you know exactly what I'm saying. I don't need more details for you, you know narcissism. You've been there, you've felt narcissism, and you'll feel it forever, but you will heal, but you won't forget. You can't talk it, you can't explain it, the twists, the turns, the manipulation, the smear, the devalue, the circular conversations, the discard, and every ounce of pain in between. A narc relationship has no words, just feelings. Who's the victim and who's the narc? The narc's the victim, the victim's the narc. It's a role reversal scripted by them. And trying to get out of that role, it's, it's bloody hard work. With lots of information, talking and listening to people in the same situations. Friends aren't friends, but flying monkeys. Family won't listen to your confused rants. Isolation, despair and loneliness are what's left. We're searching for validation through YouTube videos, Google searches and forums. It's the only way forward to knowing we were chosen because we're good people. Have we really been abused? Are they really a narc? Have we made a mistake? It's a horrendous black hole. It's the twilight zone. It's another dimension. It's the upside down world. It's a horrendous black hole. Two worlds exist, our world and their world. Those who have not yet suffered, not yet felt narcissism. I don't hold anything against the world. It's just that they're in the other worlds, one where which, which I once existed. But now we are in this world and we're in the world where people hear us mention the word narcissism. And they say, oh, is that the one where people fancy themselves and look in the mirror? These words ring in our ears. You must have known. I would never let anyone hurt me. Why didn't you leave? They must have really loved you to act like that. These words we've all heard, these words insult us. These words are said by people we once were. We would have said the same thing before we fell down the rabbit hole. But we're in the other world now, not in theirs. How the hell do we get them to understand? How do we explain our world to those in their world? If only they knew. These people, they are a human, but they are not human. We should not let them live our lives, run our lives. Our lives are our lives. We existed before they came along and will exist after them. But hopefully now we have the chance to warn the other world what a narcissist is. We need to post on our Facebook page the awareness poster. We need to share videos, not just in those groups for abuse victims. We need to share them everywhere we can. We know the red flags. We need to share it with the other world. We need to own our experience. We need to stand up to these narcs. They're just people. They're not devils. They're not demons. They're just sad bastards. They have a, who have a hold over us because of the lack of awareness, because the other world know nothing of ours. 
Narcs know the no contact rule. They know how hard it is to explain the disorder. They know it's unbelievable. They know they can hide behind the lack of awareness. They just exist behind the lack of understanding and confusion. The disbelief from those who haven't felt narcissism. It's time we stood up to them. They're just sad people who thrive off our pain. We need to put our heads above the parapet and stop treating them like they're some kind of demon humanoid. They're just fuckwits. We need to stand up to them and call them out. They've had it easy for, for far too long. Every day should be awareness day and just stop letting them hide behind the hype. Life is too short. Your life is valuable to you, not to them. Don't let your life be valuable to those who use its value for their own gain. We all came into this world alone. We existed before the narc came along. We will exist again. Life is a valuable gift. It's our gift. Please cherish it. Please do not end with a head full of regret. Life is precious. Let's live life to the full. So I wrote that. Hopefully to help us get awareness. Um, so that's really all I've got to say on this one. For a change. <laughs> Normally I've got far too much to say and I can't shut up. Seven minutes. Whoa. I think that's my record. Let's keep it that way and shut up now, Val. Listen, guys. <laughs> I'm going to go. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you to everybody that's supporting me. Um, the trolls can sod off. <laughs> I've always got to have a last word, haven't I? Right. Stay safe. Bye-bye.